ladies, uh, welcome. Uh, it's good to be back. Um, kind of haven't feels like I haven't been on here for a while. Um, yeah, um, uh, I've just basically come on just to to let all my YouTube um, customers for my Etsy store know that. Uh, I'm switching to Zibbit. Um, Etsy is far too expensive. Uh, and also to warn people not to open an Etsy store. And if they have, they can uh, export their images to Zibbit. And if you need any help with that, just ask me. But that's only if you've got, like me, like a hundred pictures that you don't want to put up again. Um, I'll very quickly just say... I got my bill because they charge you three and a half percent of all sales per month and it was $55 for the month, 75 in total but for the month I just had to pay 55 and I worked it out and I made 250 a month in sales so to me that is a, a lot more than three and a half percent and it couldn't be the listing fees because it's only 20 cents a listing and I, I haven't put up more than 130, so it's definitely, it's a big rip-off. So basically, do not open an Etsy store. So I'm on Zibbit now, but my Etsy store is still up. Um, because I'm not going to pay the ridiculous fee. You have to pay $70, to, like I have to pay all of my outstanding balance to close it. And I just refuse to pay it, so it's going to be up. And I just hope people don't buy from it. <laughs> of, of course, I'll still send them the things, but um, I'm, I'm, you know, it's just going to be up until Etsy tells me, look, you're like a hundred dollars behind. We're going to shut you down, and it's like, good, shut me down. But because to shut down the shop, you need to pay your outstanding balance, and I, I refuse to p pay those crooks any more money. It's ridiculous. Um, Zibbit is very reasonable. You pay 10 bucks a month. There's no listing fees. There's no fees on top of what you make. So, yeah, good on your Zibbit. All right. So, I'll also show you a few of the things that I've got in my store as well. Um, so, I've got my computer on the side of me so I can tell you how much everything is also i made a big mistake with my etsy store of selling everything in australian dollars because i thought me being in australia i might as well put big mistake um because everything i buy is in us dollars like i buy from aliexpress and um as a lot of you know because you buy from there Teresa. i know you do so you know that everything is sold in US dollars so yeah I mean I w you know at the end of the day if something's a dollar maybe it's a dollar twenty so it's not that big of a loss but um yeah so that's why in my zippet store everything I hope I put it in US dollars so it's in US dollars All right so uh, we'll start with this. This is um three millimeter ivory trim, and this is very good quality. And um, I'm selling two meters, not a yard. So there's ninety centimeters in a yard, and there's a hundred centimeters in a meter. So you get ten cents extra in a meter than you do a yard. Um, Pretty sure I'll bet, well, I wouldn't bet my life on it, but I'm pretty sure that's the case. Uh, if anyone would like to verify that, I'd really appreciate it. So you get two metres, and the reason why I'm selling it in metres is I bought it in metres. Like I said, if I buy something in yards, I'll sell it in yards. If I buy it in metre, I'll sell it in metre. If I buy it in Australian dollars, uh, 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 American dollars, I'll sell it in American dollars. Right. Yeah, so um, two two meters for for a dollar, so fifty cents each. And um, I hope you can see that lovely color when it's all together like that. It's a lot easier to see it than like that. 
beautiful ivory, three millimeter. And so I've got plenty of that. There's a uh, 120 meters on that reel, so plenty of that. And um, these I only got um, five yards of each of these. These are like the cream chiffon. Um, so that's why I'm selling them in half a yard because I don't have that much. And if they sell well, then I'll, I'll get more. That's what my reasoning behind the the purchase. So I wouldn't call this a wine, and I wouldn't call it. I might call it a burgundy or, or a maroon. I think I got it listed as a maroon. So this is good for doing um, like Moulin Rouge projects. It's a beautiful trim. It's like the the cream, but different colour. So it's six centimetres across. I don't know if that helps me putting my finger there. Um, so that's um, a, a dollar fifty for half a yard. So I've got that beautiful trim there. And then we've got again um, half, half a yard. Um, baby pink and this is uh, 150 again gorgeous so it's exactly like the white one but uh, in terms of uh, the way it looks material and then I've got these these are a little bit like the pink and white mixed carnations but these are smaller these are three centimeters whereas the other ones are four centimeters and I don't know if you can see they've got gl glittery ends on them they're very cute so they're paper white paper carnations um, they told they're advertised as ivory but it looks more like white to me. So I've got, I don't know if you can see that sparkle. So they are, just look at my pewter. They are 90 cents and you get six. The the other ones I was telling you about, they're $1.20 because they're four centimetres. And it's the price I paid. I probably didn't pay as much for these. So they're, they're 90, 90 cents for six for them. Um, oh, I've got these flowers. These are really cute. Um, there's 12 of these for $1.20. So these are 2 centimeter heads. Aren't they just adorable? So, yeah, you'll, you'll get them like that. And there's 12 for uh, $1.20. And the, the width of the head is two centimeters. Isn't that cute? That's the back. So I've got them in pink. And there's a lot of ladies, I know Kay and um, Al John, they like their earthy colors. Um, these are really lovely. These are orangey. They can pass as peach too, I think. Maybe you can just sew them down a bit. Aren't they gorgeous? There's a lovely earthy feel to them. So they're a dollar twenty for twelve. So. got these beautiful rhinestones. I, I made my first sale on Sibbet with these and um, from a UK lady. Uh, if you're watching, uh, please let me know what your YouTube name is so I can sub it to you. 
So these are two for a dollar sixty and they're eighteen millimeters. And they also threw in these samples, aren't they adorable? If anyone would be interested in me ordering more of these, let me know. Cute. I know Sonia, you like those things, don't you? But um yeah, so I got 30 of those and I'm selling them in two, so there's 15 in stock. Yeah, there they are. Uh, one, 1 1.8 centimeters, so just under two centimeters. 18 millimeters is just under two centimeters. There we go. And they were a dollar, a dollar sixty for two. Yeah, they're not cheap, are they? Um. Oh, these were really popular. Uh, I don't know if you remember. I used to sell their embroidered ones, the embroidered um, tr lace trim on tulle. I had the pink, violet, and blue. <clears throat> I tried some different colours. Frank, I, I couldn't find the same actually. <laughs> but um, so I got instead of the violet, this is a lilac. So this is a, a lighter one. And they're actually cheaper than what I used to sell them. Um, a dollar twenty. I'm selling them now because I must have got them cheaper this time around. Sometimes I have like five, ten percent off, so it just depends when you buy them if you're lucky enough. So they're um a dollar twenty for two yards. So you, that works out to sixty cents a yard. That's pretty good, I think. And um, oh, don't let me find the width. Uh, four centimeter diameter. One, two, three, four. Yeah, four centimeter. Forty. Yeah, that's right. Forty millimeters is what they're advertised as. So that's the. The lilac and also um, zippet don't have an option where you can pick the color so if you're buying these um, let me know which color you like and also if you want I can do one yard in one color and one yard in the other color yeah. and then there is the gold this is lovely for um, any vintage projects I know um, mm, dwellers would, would like this. So there's that one there. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. Also, um, if anyone hasn't got their tag hop uh, thing is up. Um, yeah, we've got the 14th. I think that's a couple of days. Um, I'd really appreciate it if everyone can have them up by the 14th. And then I believe on the 21st I'll be drawing the prizes. Um, because I can't draw the prizes for everyone unless everyone has put them up because the idea of a hop is uh, people have to leave comments on everyone that has entered in the hop. But there, there's still a bit of time. What's the date? It's the 13th. So tomorrow, oh, um, the Americans, your Friday is two days from today. But if any American subbies that are participating are watching, can you please try and have it up by tomorrow? Thank you. Um, okay, so this is a, a rose rose pink. This is lovely. It's like a fuchsia or a rose pink if you're the type that 
isn't keen on the baby pink and you like the more deeper, uh, richer pink, you'd love this. It's beautiful. Um, yeah. yeah, so I've got five colours there. Yes, two, two yards for a dollar twenty. We've got the white one. White. This can be tea dyed or avocado dyed. Gorgeous, beautiful. I'll just show you um, three other uh, trims that I've got and that would be all. Also, I'll be to promote my Zippet store. Um, please um, go on to my Zippet store. A little giveaway here. And to go to my Zippet store, it's the same as you did with my Etsy. Um, on the right hand corner, I'll, I'll actually show you. Hold on. Um, go to my YouTube channel because because some people don't know that there's a link that takes you straight there so. So see the, that's my channel there, so that, that's the channel up, and on the right hand corner here, see that, that that's the, the link that takes you, it used to be it, and now it's, of course, see, but I've changed it, so if you click on, on that, here, click, it takes you straight to my Zippet store, which is this here. I'm working on a banner. If anyone's interested, I'll give you the name of the lady. She's on a Etsy store and she makes banners. They're about $3.50. And you give her your details and she puts your banner out there. So I'm still waiting on it. But yeah. Freeze Art. I'm pretty sure it's called Freeze Art. So if you type in Freeze Art in Etsy and tell her I sent you over. Um, yeah, she'll look after you. Yeah, so, yeah, and for my giveaway, all I want you to do is just to go through my shop. There's my, my shop there. And from each page, I want you to pick something you like. So that's one page there. And then we'll go to... So I've got five pages on here. Um... But they, they can't be anything handmade, so they can't be like flowers or projects I've made, just um, craft supplies. And we'll go to the next one, two. Right, so it's the second page. And, and also it has to be the lowest shipping, like it can't be the highest shipping. Highest shipping would probably be things 
that can't be posted as a parcel so things that aren't flat so that that's homemade it's considered a crafting supply but I'll make them but that's the highest shipping because I won't be able to ship that as a letter but everything most of my things are on the lowest shipping anyway yeah, you can tell by looking at it if it looks like they can be posted as a letter then they can yeah so that's so and so on so you just go to every single page well, what's on the fifth page I wouldn't have a lot oh, okay I've got a few things yeah All right yeah so that's um my my store and oh shit got my nails done and it's really hard to do anything oh, i did it myself and i want to do some nail art i've seen some really cool tutorials where they paint flowers on i'll see how i go if i think i do a good enough job i'll do a tutorial uh, Oh, here we are, Visha. All right. Yeah, um, so I'll run my giveaway for for about a, a week. So in a week I will draw the winner and the winner wins five items. I will actually have two winners. So one winner will be from the comments that you just all you have to do is be a subscriber leave a comment and the five things you pick you will win the other winner will be uh, for people that do a VR and of course are subscribers and that will go in the draw to win 10 things of their choice and also the people that do a VR um, to be fair to the ladies that leave comments, they'll only go in the draw for for the ten things, not not just the comments things, if if that makes sense. So um oh today's the uh, the eleventh of, of Sunday. Eleven, uh, sorry, the thirteenth of July, Sunday. So on the twentieth, which is next week, on a Sunday. I will do the draw for the winner for my Zippet store. And also, if you're doing the VR, um, I would like the heading to be Seriously Scrapping's Zippet store. VR to Seriously Scrapping's Zippet store giveaway. Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks, guys. This one, let's see if I can find Oh, that's beautiful. This is um, sold by the meter. It's a crochet trim that is, let me find the width, four centimeters in diameter. This is exquisite. Uh, see that? Beautiful trim there. Isn't that gorgeous? It's a beautiful crochet trim there. So um, I think I've got ten meters of this. So I'm I'm selling one meter for a dollar twenty. It's beautiful. Baby pink crochet trim. And then there's this one. I got five meters of this, so I'm selling it in half a meter. Let me find that one. And this gorgeous one, I'm selling half a meter for a dollar twenty. This is seven centimeters, so it's a lot bigger than the other one. And it's got a lovely cream to it, and the top is like um it's like a looks like a gold 
kind of chocolate, like a mocha etching on top of that. Isn't that beautiful? That will look so lovely on those beautiful um, journals, uh, vintage fabric lace journals. Isn't that beautiful? Wow.